We are staying on top of this story this morning, our top story. I want you to take a live look at Thailand. We are seeing a lot of action this morning. At this point, we know that they have rescued 11 yes. boys in all. Yes, confirmed 11 here, which means uh, you've got two members who are still in the cave right now in a Thailand. A boy in the coach. Uh, uh, presumably, yeah, a boy and a coach at this point who remain in the cave here. Uh, so again, I think we're going to bring this uh, live shot here full so you can take a look. Oh, no, actually, I'm sorry. This is new video. We wanted to show you this, that we're just getting into the newsroom. Uh, this is actually one of the ambulances leaving the cave just a short time ago, headed for that hospital. Uh, the hospital about 60 miles away from the cave. Uh, but as for the eight boys who were already rescued and in the hospital, we do want to update you on those. Uh, real quick. They do show signs of infection, Thai health officials said. Uh, as a precaution, they're still being separated from their parents. They're uh, only allowed to visit through glass and talk over the phone, but they are described as being in really good spirits considering all of that. And Courtney, um, yesterday we talked about they were able to work actually a lot quicker than they were the day before. Right. Today, though, they're expecting to be the longest because not only were they working on getting members of the, uh, the team out of the cave, there were also Navy SEAL members, and there are three Navy SEAL members and a medic right. who were staying with them in the cave. They've got to get them out as well here, but uh, daylight is winding down there in Thailand. They've been at it for about eight hours now. Yeah, they're 11 hours ahead of us. We know that the mission on Sunday, 11 hours, yesterday, nine hours, yes. uh, getting ready to hit the ninth hour this morning as we go forward, but incredible. Uh, a wonderful so thing. So far, we've so seen good. Better than expected. Much better. And, and hopefully they're able, they said if they're not able to get them all out today, they will go back in tomorrow, but they really wanted to wrap things up today. And our coverage is going to continue this morning of the rescue efforts in Thailand. We will send you any alert with uh, an update on the operation on your phone if you have the 10 News app.